Hey, what's up, everyone? It is Techwares, and today is November 18th, 2024. Now, once again, I want to talk about Intel Arc Battle Mage. The launch is imminent, all right? We're really, really close to the launch of the first Intel Arc Discrete Graphics, Battle Mage Discrete Graphics card, all right? So, this article is from uh, Video Cards. It was released yesterday and I made a video about it. I made a few videos about this, but in my previous video, I did touch on this uh, Intel Arc Battle Mage. Um, I don't know why it says SOC. I think this image was just taken from another website and they just added the 2024-12 to it because it's, it's, it's not the SOC. It's actually the Intel Arc Discrete Graphics that is launching uh, next month. So... Uh, video cards just touches on this uh, a little bit. They say um, there's a there's a new update following the disclosure that Intel might be the first company to showcase its next gen GPUs. According to rumors, Intel originally intended to showcase its Arc Battle Mage discrete GPUs by Black Friday, late November. However, at this moment, it appears that this date might have shifted slightly. All right, the the December showcase was already teased by Golden Pig upgrade. A reliable hardware leaker who mentioned that we might get an update on Battle Mage next month. However, apart from a rather short message on a social platform, there has been no confirmation of this report. All right, the new teaser comes from uh, Thomas um, Gagronski. I don't know if I say that name. Uh, a data miner known for providing quick updates on unreleased uh, hardware shipping manifest, many of which are related to Intel's Arc Battle Mage GPU series update. Oh yeah, they give an update. The teaser image was actually reposted from Gaz uh, Gazlog. Yeah, this this is just a repost. Um, this is yet another uh, indicator that we might indeed hear about ba uh, Battle Mage next month, and perhaps even learn its release dates. Its release date. All right. Uh, this is significant considering that CES 2025 is already packed with hardware announcements, and so on. Yeah, and um, somebody asked a question. Um, uh, they said. Will Intel Arc Battle Mage GPUs be the last of discrete graphics cards that Intel is going to be releasing or plans to release? And uh, Bionic Squash or Squash Bionic replied saying, nah, they still have plans for DGPUs after Battle Mage. And um, I want to just uh, say they actually they really do. They're, they're actually working on XE3 architecture, which is uh, Celestial, which is supposed to be uh, after... You know, it was supposed to come after Battle Mage. So uh, they go on to say, however, in this case, it might be hard to say when such XE3 codename Celestial Architecture would appear. We only know at this point that the next inline mobile chips are set to feature this architecture, although at a much smaller level. So uh, as far as Intel Arc Battle Mage goes, um, the XE2 architecture is actually already out. Uh, Lunar Lake utilizes XC2 uh, graphics, and these are some of the improvements, um, graphics improvements on Lunar Lake, which I'm pretty sure we're going to be seeing. We're, we're going to be seeing this, uh, some of these, or maybe all of these, in actual XE2 HPG, which is Battle Mage. Uh, so uh, EDP 1.5 enhanced XCSS kernels. Uh, in new XMX engines, enhanced ray tracing units, uh, we might see VVC decode, um, efficiency uh, optimized media and display. It's going to be great. All right. So these are some uh, improvements. There's some more uh, improvements uh, with XC2, enhanced vector engines, larger ray tracing units, deeper cache. Uh, native hardware support to be executed in indirect commands, um, performance and efficiency optimized front to end, uh, the second gen XE cores, some more information about XE2. I'm pretty sure we're going to get similar type of slides with when um, uh, the discrete graphics cards are going to be uh, announced and released. And here's a new uh, XC ray tracing units and this is just a screenshot from uh, a 
an, an, an ex-employee at Intel. And as you can see, uh, they were um, the, they were the project lead, the lead project architect for XE Plus, which is Alchemist Plus. They also worked on XE3, which is Celestial, and I've never heard of this until now, um, XE3P, GPUIP. So we know XE, we know XE Plus, we know XE3. We haven't really, we don't really know much what XE3P is. So that's that. And once again, Intel has two Intel Connection events coming up this month. One is in uh, Bangalore, India. It's the Intel Connection Bangalore. It takes place on November 22nd. So just next week, actually, no, this week, uh, Friday of this week is when that's going to be going down. And then a few days uh, a few days later, we're going to have Intel Connection Chengdu, which is uh, taking place in China, in uh, Chengdu, China, and that's taking place on November 26th. So, honestly, um, this is where we might be hearing about um, uh, Battle Mage DC graphics cards. I mean, hopefully, right? It's, uh, it kind of lines up with the rumored December 13th release. So, I can't wait for uh, this week and the upcoming next week. So, uh, I want to just make a I just want to say this. I've seen these two uh, images right here posted on. Well, they were in another video from another YouTuber. And I got to say, these are completely wrong. Um, these are definitely not not uh, not correct. They're definitely not true. Uh, so just take that. I don't really want to say. I don't want to throw the YouTuber under the bus. Um, I did just grab these screenshots from their video. And I, I just wanted to put them in this video and just say these are not right. These are not wrong. Uh, these are not uh, correct. So, if you've seen these, I don't want to say the YouTuber's video, but um, th these are not right. Now, I want to just give um, kind of like an exclusive, I guess you can call it exclusive, uh, and show you something here. So, check this out, guys. This is uh, from Shipping, uh, Export, and Import Manifests. All right. And as you can see, this is from the 9th, right? So, this is from September, end of September, and as you can see, the description of goods, we have the paper cover, or cushion, Intel BMG, which is Battle Mage. So, these are just packaging, as you can see, a packaging paper box for Intel uh, BMG, all right, and then right here, so here's some more, the, basically, they're getting the Packaging, shipments already for the the launch, and let me scroll here just to make it easier for you to read. To read. Intel BMG B five eighty. So yes, that is the first official. I mean, you can call it official confirmation that Intel might be launching. The B580 first, all right, so the B580 might be, according to this, I haven't seen anything else, anything else in the uh, shipping manifests, however, I do see the Intel B580 discrete graphics cards ready to ship, the packaging is, the packaging is getting all ready, and yeah, that is the pretty much the first confirmation of the B580, so I'm pretty sure this one, this one is going to be uh, kind of, sort of like the limited edition one that Intel sells themselves, similar to the limited edition ones that they sold uh, with Alchemist, so it seems like uh, we're going to be getting Intel Arc B580 limited edition graphics cards. Now, I don't think the B580 is going to be like the flagship, I'm pretty sure Intel is going to have like a a higher performing uh, graphics cards. So it seems like they're going to be taking the strategy of releasing kind of the, you can sort of call it mid-range uh, first, that the, they're more affordable, uh, more people are, they appeal to more people because of the price. So it seems like Intel is going to be launching the first next-gen GPU. They're going to beat AMD and NVIDIA to the punch, and they're going to release 
sort of like a mid-range, uh, very affordable graphics card first, just to set the, you know, just to say, hey, we're in this early, so, you know, uh, go check out our video card, and uh, hopefully uh, you can purchase it, so that's it for the video, it's all, already long enough, man, so thank you guys for listening, thank you guys for watching, let me know what you think in the comments, are you excited for Intel Arc Battle Mage, what do you think? Take care, everyone. Peace.